After my last video about um, Shopee's transition to um, seller printing the airway bills, there are a couple of questions surrounding the airway bill, and I wanted to discuss that with you. Coming right up. Hi guys, this is Pat, and you're in Pat Kintos Review TV. So if you're new here on my channel, I do reviews about Smart Padala, PayMaya, True Money, Shopee, Computer Shop, GCash, YouTube, and other stuff na meron akong experience at ginawa ko na yun ng videos and playlists na makikita nyo dito sa taas. At kung bago kayo dito sa channel to, you may want to consider subscribing to my channel. Okay guys, so anong-ano ba yung mga question about the airway bill? Merong guidelines na sinet si Shopee for you to print yung airway bill. So we need to follow these guidelines because pwedeng hindi kunin ng courier yung binok nating item na for ship out. And also, there are a couple of sellers na nagtatanong like kung bakit, pwede mag-opt out, etc. And sasagutin natin din yan maya-maya. Okay. Pero in terms of guidelines, let's first discuss the guidelines. Okay. Number one, guideline. So, sabi dito, airway bills are auto-generated and can be printed after sellers have arranged pickup for their orders. Um, number two, airway bills must be printed in good quality A6 sticker paper such as yung thermal paper na katulad nito yan to avoid issues with scanning ayun nga guys sabi ko nga di ba iwasan natin yung mga inkjet na sticker papers kasi pag nabasa yon mag smudge baka magkaroon kayo ng problema so it's either pagka ship nyo maayos na picturean pero along the way pag tina-transition na yan ginagamit pa rin yung ano yung QR niyan ini-scan pa rin yan pag kunyari hindi na mabasa nagkaroon ng smudge then pwedeng mawala yung item or pwedeng mag RTS di ba okay let's move on for optimal printing quality Shopee recommends printing airway bills on thermal printers such as this yan yung pinakita ko sa inyo to avoid ink smudges to help seller adjust to this requirement we have secured discounted rates for a limited time on printing equipment okay next Airway bills must be securely attached to each parcel before ship out. Next, airway bills must follow the format seen on the seller center. Any edits, revision, or addition to this format may, may cause refusal of parcels by our courier. So basically, guys, once you download yung shipping labels sa seller center, then just print it. Wag nyo nang i-alter or wag kayo magdagdag. Pagka-print nyo, isalpak nyo dun sa um, pouches or sa packaging, then you're good to go. So that's the general guidelines when printing yung airway bills. Ngayon, let's answer a couple of questions surrounding this change. Okay. So number one, why is Shopee shifting to own printing of airway bills? So ayan, pero hindi ko, ko nabasahin. Pero ang gist niyan is ano lang, para daw maging mas streamline yung processing ng packing ng mga orders at hindi na tayo kailangan maghintay para sa courier na mag-print. Which is, I agree, and my point, na minsan kasi nawawala ni rider yung mga way bill and may binuka tapos wala kang way bill hindi kawawa ka di ba so isa yon sa magandang solusyon na mareresolve niya yung ganung issue and at the same time meron ding mga advance booking na pwede mong gawin kausapin mo lang yung rider mo i pwede mo nang isama yung um, mga binuk mo kinabukasan dun sa pick up mo for today so pwede naman yun so what is the implementation timeline um, so ayan Pero basically, the, the gist of that is that they will be implementing this by batches. So, kung, kung kailan mo natanggap yung notification and anong date yung nakalagay doon, basically, yun yung start na hindi ka na bibigyan ng way bill. Is there a required printer brand unit for printing of airway bills? Yan. Pero, so again, the gist of that, sinasabi lang yan, is wala namang kailangan na specific brand. But we need to follow yung general guidelines na na-mention ko kanina. Wala naman silang in-endorse na brand, so at least, ano, wala silang bias. Okay, number four, can sellers opt out of this? So, yan. The answer is no. Um, Shopee will require all sellers to print their own airway bills to help streamline and speed up the fulfillment process. Number five, can I edit the format of air airway bills? No. Then please avoid, in avoid including other unnecessary printed information on your parcel. Please follow Shopee's guideline in printing your own airway bills via seller center accordingly. Last, 
will all carriers discontinue providing airway bills? So, all carriers are included in the change. However, sellers who are part of the first batch will continue receiving airway bills for GoGo Express until further notice. Like, ako na experience ko yan. Dalawing career ko, actually. Um, isang Ninja Van and isang um, GoGo Express or Expose. Kasi nagpalit na siya na pangalan ngayon. Ex GoGo Express na daw siya. Pero Expose kapag integrated or meaning yung pouches. And then GoGo Express kapag own packaging. So, tinanong ko yung rider na nagpipick up for exposed. And sabi niya, wala naman daw sa kanilang announcement, but sinasab tinatanong na siya ng mga ibang sellers na kung kailan, kung kailan tatanggalin yung airway bill. Pero sabi niya, as of the meantime na wala, walang announcement, then continue pa rin sila magpo-provide ng airway bills. Pero parang hindi maganda yung ganun, guys. Kasi tipong biglaan na lang, paano kung meron kang 50 to, ewan ko, 30 to 50 orders, ba? Then exposed. And expect mo, sasabihan ka kung kailan. Pero parang wala naman, hindi ka naman sinabihan. Bigla na lang walang airway bill. So biglang, ano, during the day na ipipick up niya, time na ipipick up niya yan, magkiprint ka pa ng airway bill. So medyo, ano, medyo hassle nung araw na yon. And at the same time, kung ang gagawin mo naman is everyday ka magpiprint ng airway bill, tapos nagpiprint din naman si Expo o si GoGo Express, then sayang yung, ano, yung 30 cents sa thermal sticker, ba? So hindi ko alam kung saan lugar, pero sana they will make it definite yung announcement kung kailan. Para naman, like ako, ganun ang ginagawa ko, nagpiprint pa rin ako. Sayang, sayang lang. 30 cents din yun. Pag naipon mo, magkano rin yun, diba? Uh, isa pa guys, naisip ko lang. Yes, ito yung reason ni Shopee para ma-streamline yung process. E di, sana kahit papano, pinasa ni Shopee yung responsibility ng airway bill sa sellers. Di dapat yung ano yung cost of the courier, yung shipping shipping cost. Sana kahit bumaba, di, sana, di ba, binaba nila ng piso, di ba? Kung 45 yan, ginawa 44, di ba? Kasi, nag, pinasa lang, pinasa nila yung cost lahat sa ano, sa mga seller. Pero, yung operating cost nila on printing airway bills, di ba, nawala. Mas justifiable sana itong reason nila kung like, bababaan nila ng konti yung cost ng shipping, di ba, versus sa uh, bigla na lang nila pinasa. Ewan ko, that's, my, that's just my opinion, guys. Kayo, ano sa tingin nyo? Makatarungan ba talaga to? Ewan ko, ewan ko guys ha. Though additional cost kasi to, kaya medyo resistant din ako. Pero wala, nakabili na rin ako eh. Anyway, so, yun lang guys. So, if you have more question about these recent changes sa Shopee, um, comment it below and we'll try to, ano, to answer your question. If ni, ni ko alam, then I'll try to um, research and provide you answers. Okay? Yun lang guys. I hope you can like this video. Leave a thumbs up. And if not, okay lang naman din. But continue to support me by subscribing to my channel by clicking the subscribe button and also the bell button sa tabi ng subscribe para makareceive kayo ng latest notification sa lahat ng upload ko. Again guys, this is Pat Quinto and you're in Pat Quinto's Review TV. Bye-bye!